What is up, guys? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back with Beak and Lulu. How we doing? Hey, guys, we're back here with 48 Days Till Max. And if you guys saw yesterday's video, you know we're kind of bummed out, dude. We had kind of a family emergency. My grandma, the OG Beaker's Lab legend, she passed away uh, two days ago. And, dude... It's been hard. She's the one who nicknamed me Beaker. In fact, I've talked about it a lot. You guys probably know that. But I think for that reason, she's like probably the Beaker's Lab OG. So anyway, guys, another thing that I've realized and, and a lot of people, you guys and, you know, my family and friends have been like, yo, like, don't you want to take some days off? Just like do nothing. And I tried to do that this morning. I honestly did. I don't think I'm built for that anymore, dude. We have done a video every day since January 1st, 2019. We're almost at two years. There's been so much good and bad, mostly bad, I guess, in 2020. But guys, it has kept me sane doing this every day. And I know it has for you guys too. We gotta get back out there and grind and get some loot and make our ancestors proud. Because Days Till Max resumes in three, two, one. Yo, gang, I am so tired. It's crazy. Like, I haven't had to deal with this that much. And I so feel for you guys who have big families. And so inevitably, like, maybe you've had to deal with loss at a younger age. I'm an only child and my mom is an only child. So our family's so small. So when something like this happens, it's it's huge. But you know what I did last night that, that really cheered me up? Uh, a couple things. But first of all, I was looking at bunnies. You guys know how... how Oh, by the way, we're going to take this. Guys, I've been, I've been looking at adopting another bunny. I got a couple good leads that I'm going to follow. The last one that I really wanted to get, uh, he was so far away. I, I couldn't get there, and I just wanted him to be adopted as soon as possible. Anyway, let's go. So, yeah, uh, really, I mean, when, when, you're, when you're looking at adopting a bunny or any pet, really, I, I, like, whenever I inquire about them, whenever I email about them, I'm just like, hey, if they've been adopted, awesome. Like, I'm happy for them. I just want them to have a good home uh, where they're safe and, and happy because, man... It sucks. Like, now is a great time for pets. Like, everybody wants pets. But in normal times, like, pets just sit at these animal shelters, dude, for forever. And it's so sad. But anyway, guys, I'm, I'm like, literally bombing myself out more than I should right now. Uh, yeah, we're hopefully going to get another bunny. Or two. Can you imagine if we got two? All right, man. Let's get the other crew going. You know, I guess we're just stuck on the hoggo gang right now i i haven't even paid attention to what we're using what we're doing it doesn't matter all right let's get a rage ball down there sup oh, that was perfect dude yes yeti get in there no why did you turn around you're so stupid hey what's in here uh a billion traps oh my god this is gonna be so stupid Oh my god. Yeah, that was... I think 10 hog riders just got hit by traps. That was so dumb. Alright, well, let's get in there. Oh my god, stop. Stop, 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 stop. I gotta tell you, man. Whenever we... I mean, it especially happens with hog riders, but whenever we're doing any army and we just, like, sweep through the middle, I get kind of like a... I don't know. Do you guys get this? Do you get kind of like a... Kind of like a little rush when you do that? Like, yeah, buddy. Like, you get through the middle. Your whole army is usually right there. And, you know, you're hitting some spells. You're, you're rushing through as fast as you can. Warden, you're being dumb. You guys just see that? He was, like, hopping over walls instead of defending himself. Whatever. Kind of what he does. Anyway, guys, I think that's it for this one. Um, Can we get a little bit of that elixir? I bet we can, dude. Hang on. All right. Let's distract. Uh, Not exactly where I meant you to go, but okay. Oh, that distraction went great. Good job, team. Oh, my God. Cool. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's cool. You know what I think is good? We actually don't have to do anything today. Tomorrow, we've got a big event going on with the with the mortars. The, did you guys see that? Back, let me go back and show you guys. Back at the base, he's going to be done tomorrow. That's going to be a good pick-me-up, dude. And I don't know. If any of you guys have gone through this... Hi, Lulu. You definitely make me feel better. <laughs> You're such a goof. If any of you guys have lost like a parent or a grandparent before, uh, how long does it take to get over, not get over it, but you know, how long does it take to feel sort of normal again? I don't really know. Uh, I thought I was prepared for something like this and I wasn't. But either way, guys, we got this to look forward to tomorrow. And I, I really do thrive on stuff like this. Whenever we have something planned, something scheduled like this, it really does make me feel like I, I, I wake up and I'm like, oh yeah, we got something. We got a project finishing today. That's going to be good. All 
right, guys, we're gonna do one more raid and then we're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna go see my family. My girlfriend actually just went over there. She's she's the best, dude. It's so nice when when something like this happens and you have like a, like a best friend or a girlfriend or a boyfriend that can help you with this stuff because like I'd be lost otherwise. Cause I, I, I keep telling you guys like I'm an only child. My mom's an only child. Our family's really small. Weird, but I mean, I like it. It's cool. Anyway, guys, let's hit up this one. Uh, Optimus Prime, cool. What's your clan name? <laughs> it reminds me of that movie, Super Troopers. You guys know that was from Vermont. That was like based in Vermont where I'm from. And like, I don't know. I've never seen cops that act like that, but at the same time, I mean, the drink and the maple syrup thing. Okay, we, we, we do actually do that. But anyway. All right, guys, can we get him? Can we get him one more? Do we want to? No, 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 no. I need to save some. Okay, so Queen, we just need to drop a rage for her, or maybe even not. I don't know, man. I can't even think straight, and that's fine. I was telling you guys yesterday, I think I got to play some games. Like Clash is one of those games where you don't always have to think a lot when you're playing. You, you got to think if you're in Clan War. And so I opted out of the rest of Clan War League. I was like, you know, Shane, I'm out. Like, keep me out. Keep, keep me out. And, you know, my clan mates all understand, obviously. But yeah, there's some games where you really gotta think and some that you can just do, you can just play for hours and not think about a single thing and like really just waste time. I think I need some of that right now, dude. And you know what the, you know what one of the worst things is, dude? My birthday is coming up and it's gonna be so weird to, I don't know. I don't wanna bum you guys out. I don't wanna bum you guys. Anyway, guys, let's get in here, boom. All right, we got a straight shot into the town hall now, but we got to, um, let's see. Let's do a quick. We'll do a quick right away. Right away. All right. Whoa, why was the screen just moving? Did you guys see that? What is happening? No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, that's rough. Oh, my goodness, that's rough. Yo, look at that fight between the queen. I wish, why don't they change the warden so he fights back? It's dumb. It's dumb that like he has the ability to fight back yet he gets distracted by anything. If if a hero is right up in his face punching him, how about he fights back? I don't know, whatever. Anyway guys, it's gonna be over today. We're, we're not gonna chill here too long, but uh, I just wanted to check in with you guys because it really does mean a lot to me to just check in with you guys every day and do this. And second of all, the fact that we have this Man, how many days has it been since January 1st? I bet I can ask, you know who. How many days has it been since January 1st, 2019? It was 677 days ago. See, that's what I'm talking about, man. No matter what, I, I, I keep telling myself this and I know it to be true. My grandma understands how much that means to me and like would never want me to change that part of my life as I would for you guys. Like if anything ever, ha I, I know we're getting kind of dark here. We're gonna get out of here. But if anything ever happened to me, I wouldn't want you guys to change your life one bit. I want you to just remember, remember the good, dude. Remember the good. 677 days what huh and in the grand scheme of things that's nothing dude i mean like og youtubers like pewdiepie probably done like thousands right anyway guys that is it for today uh do we have enough loot for tomorrow not really but we'll see you guys here tomorrow no matter what even if we just do this tomorrow you know it depends on how we're feeling but if we just do this tomorrow guys that'll be pretty good i mean we need a distraction we always need a distraction right now uh, what do we have for for gold runes do we have any gold runes it doesn't, we can check it tomorrow. Let me just check. Dang. What about in here? Oh, okay. Okay. So we do have one gold rune. It's just right there. Okay. What about in here? Man, that would have been so sick if there was one in here. Guys, let me get that builder potion just to be sure uh, in case we need it tomorrow. Okay, cool. Anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out with me today. Uh, I know I don't feel quite like myself, but I don't think we should ever like shy away from that. Like if you're, if you're bummed out about something, 
you know, don't try to hide that from your friends and your family. Like, there's nothing wrong with that, you know? Uh, I try to tell you guys most of what's going on in my life uh, for better or worse. And I think what we got to do next, guys, I'll briefly talk to you about this, but we got to do some sort of a memorial for not just my grandma, but everybody that all of us have uh, in our lives that meant a lot to us that we lost. And whether it's, you know, I think we should sort of focus it towards Alzheimer's because honestly, that's what my grandma had. And it, oh, it makes me so mad. It makes me so mad. It's such a twisted, it's like if somebody came up with the most cruel thing you could do to a family member. It's just twisted. And so like, I, I, I would really like to do some sort of a fundraiser charity. Even if we just make the smallest dent in the world, it's something, dude. So anyway, that's it for today. We will see you guys right here tomorrow on Beaker's Lab. Whatever shape we're in, we'll see you guys then, man. Peace.